and then we're going to do some basic recording. Um, I've already loaded a blank project as you can see and I've got two slides in it. I'm just going to click record here and it's asking me if I wanted to uh, record after slide two. So I'm going to say yep, okay. Um, it comes up with this red border as you can see and a record um, dialog box. We've got the chance here to um, have it in demo mode, assessment mode, training mode or custom mode. Now to be honest what I want to do is show somebody how to do something first so I'm going to keep it in demo mode. Panning, I'm not going to have any panning. That would pan this red box to where I was pointing with my pointer. I don't want any of that happening. I don't want manual panning. So I'm going to keep that as no panning. The microphone will be my podcaster that I'm using at the moment. Um, I don't want any full motion video. There's no point for this one because I'm just going to be doing um, something in Word as you can see here. I could bring up the settings which are here. Um, to be honest I'm going to leave all these as default for this and go OK. Then I'm going to record. It allows me to calibrate my mic. You click on the auto calibrate so while you're speaking into the mic it calibrates for you. You can go OK and it'll give you a 3-2-1, don't know whether you can see that. Now we're in Word. To open up the font dialog box, click this little arrow and the font dialog box will open. Press OK to close. OK, now I'm just going to press End on the keyboard to end uh, the recording in Captivate. And as you can see, Captivate's popped up and it's given me my screens. I can now go in and edit them as I want. So that's a basic recording.